everyone. My name is Holly Dunsby Owen and I am going to be reading you some magazine snippets. Okay, let's get cracking. Evil X ripped off my face. Uh, wedding day tragedy. Uh, we said our vows and a guest dropped dead. Our brave talk saved his sister from burning alive. Oh, gosh, I am going to read this story. Well, a little bit, because it makes me a bit sick, actually. Um, I triple my pension as a sexy agony aunt. We'll find that she doesn't. So, we have Snap Happy. I know you, you guys love Snap Happy. It's absolutely brilliant. And what we have here is a picture of a cat looking very 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 miserable um, and as if it's going to bite somebody's face off um, but this person has said blackberry they've named their cat after fruit uh, excellent uh, just loves having a photo taken she's got such an award-winning smile in my opinion oh darling that is your opinion and your opinion only. I am so sorry, but that is the absolute truth. Poor cat. He was alone. Stop taking photos of him as well. It looks a bit evil. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, we're still on Snap Happy here. Um, time to celebrate. My grandparents recently celebrated their anniversary, all with a little help from our delicious coffee and walnut cake we made for them. Here they are, blowing out the candles. How interesting. Thanks so much. Right. Beauty and the Beast. Oh, God. The man apparently tearing his wife's face off, which didn't actually happen. She's only got about six stitches in her lip. Sorry, poor sausage. After Ego. Right. Now, listen, please, listen. Meet my multiple personalities, Brenda, Debbie, and Annie. Now, I, I understand that people want to be transgender, or people, you know, want to call themselves trees, or dogs, or horses, or whatever they fancy, but why would you give yourself three human names? Oh my gosh, and you should see this database as well. Fashion? No. <laughs> oh, Sodder. So this is um, this is a section um, named Blimey. I absolutely agree. Um, if I wash my towels with my clothes, they always come out smelling a bit musty. <laughs> <laughs> so instead, I washed them with hot water and vinegar before popping them in the washing machine with the laundry detergent. No more musty smells for me. Well, there we go. Well done, you. God, you are an absolute trooper. But, oh dear. We are in to confidentials, okay? So don't tell anybody. It's confidential, so um, nobody else is going to have seen this who's bought this foul magazine. No one. So don't say a word. Right. Um, I've stopped finding my husband attractive. Looking at him makes my skin crawl. <laughs> the idea of having sex makes me feel sick. <laughs> Can I get the spark back? Or is it too late? I'd say it was too late at the first hurdle, oh, my darling. Oh my goodness, I'm not going to read that advice, but it's just bloody hilarious. Yes, this was a headline that I wrote, uh, I read out earlier. Um, I triple my pension as a sexy agony aunt. Naked, blind cow, and you look about as foul as they come. Yes, she decides that when she hasn't got her grandchildren over um, to give some people advice. Um, but apparently it's not all sexy advice. It's, um, you know, 
ju just a bit of pornographic stuff. So there we go. Um, I hope you lose your pension, you slag. Piss off. Caught wed handed. Sozzled stranger broke in and the fella fell asleep on my sofa. So I married him. Is this why um, lawyers and solicitors are getting so much money these days? I've got no idea. Piss off. Right, so have an absolutely wonderful day, evening, whatever, wherever you are. And uh, please subscribe. It would be absolutely wonderful if you could comment, ding that little bell. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.